If you like, please hit subscribe and tell all your friends about the Mad Rapper Show. Thank you for tuning in to the Mad Rapper Show. I'm your host, the Mad Rapper. And on today's show, I got sent some beautiful footage of a video that just uh, just surfaced with a guy putting his, his wife on blast. And I wanted to do like a first reaction with you guys. Um, uh, so basically what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna post a link in the description below. You can have the, you can watch it with me or you can just watch my reaction. Let's see. Hopefully I don't fuck something up. I got my headphones. Let me see. And I'll try not to be too hysterical. Hey, bro, let me tell you why she's getting a divorce. It's because I caught her on this glide cheating on me. Yeah, she not already fucked one nigga up in Mississippi. Now I'm finding out she talking to you too. Yeah, yeah, tell this nigga that you fucked somebody else. Tell him. I screwed somebody. Exactly. Tell this motherfucker. And don't somebody. even sit here and try to play. I screwed somebody. She oh. fucked another nigga. And now she done brought her dumb ass back home all the way to California to I try to get back with me. And now I found out she's talking to you too. I'm not talking to you. You are talking to this motherfucker. You've been talking to this motherfucker for the longest. And he don't know. I bet you you don't know she married, do you? You don't know it. It ain't your fault. You don't know it. She lied to the other guy too. She didn't tell the guy she was married. Not, so, oh yeah, he's your friend, right? We, I bet he don't know about me. We, we don't. But you doing shit on my phone that I take care of you with, right? I pay for this fucking phone. You don't pay for the phone. I pay for every fucking thing you do. Every muscle on your body. Show them rings. Show the rings. I pay for all this fucking shit. And you, you, you take your ass on this fucking damn app and fuck with niggas, right? Huh? No. Yes, you do. No. Don't fucking lie. <laughs> and you brought your ass all the way back here just for me to find out. Because you didn't know I was going to be smart enough to add the app back. Yeah, before she walked in the house, she deleted the app. <laughs> <laughs> but I put the shit right back on there, and guess what? All your messages popped up. But it, like I said, it ain't your fault. But I just want you to know what you're dealing with. You're dealing with a slut right here. And I call her slut because she's my fucking wife and she's doing shit like this on me. You see what I'm saying? Don't cry now. Just cry. Don't fucking cry now. And yes, again, she already fucked one nigga already up in Mississippi and gonna call herself, gonna come back to me and make up for the shit. How you gonna make up for fucking somebody? Okay? Is this an earthquake? Now the comedian? Tell this, tell this nigga, you married. I'm married. And you fucked up, ain't you? And I'm fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> Why the bitch cry like that? And she's about to get a whooping. All the way back here just for this. He's just my friend. He's not your friend. The other guy was your friend, too. Oh, this bitch is down. Nobody's your friend. Nobody's your friend without your husband being involved. None of my female friends are my friends and don't know my wife. None of them. And I don't be on no fucking app talking to nobody. Why is she crying like that? All right, bro. Have a nice day. Nice night, whatever you having. But um, it's about to be on over here. Oh, no. Say bye. Say bye. Say, look, look, look at what? I don't have to look at shit. You shouldn't have been talking to nobody. Your daddy already told you. Your daddy just already. like you saying this nigga a friend. You was friending the other nigga, and you ended up in the hotel room with him, fucking him. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. You can't defend nothing. <laughs> you always trying to defend your fucked up shit. <laughs> and, this and just a minute ago, she was in here crying, talking about, why are you leaving me? Why are you leaving me? <laughs> Begging me to stay. And this the shit you doing to me? Uh 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 uh. You just ain't had a chance to get with the nigga yet. That's the only thing. That, that's that's the only difference between this nigga and the other nigga. The other nigga, you got a chance to see him. You was gonna get a chance to see. Cause that's all it takes when you communicating back and forth. One day you gonna see each other. I'm friend now. I'm friend, friend, friend. I done played the friend game with a whole bunch of damn women. Okay? <laughs> Niggas playing you. And you stupid enough to believe the shit. 
Now she went to see the other nigga. He wouldn't even let her sit come to his house. <laughs> he put her in a hotel room down the street from her uh, house. He, and he she was still fucked him like a little twenty one year old would do. Hell and yeah, she's forty one years old. She forty one. You ain't smart enough to fucking understand game. Oh, this bitch and is dumb. And then you dumb enough to come back to me trying to get me back, and you still talking to niggas. You about the most fucked up woman in the world. That is sad. I don't give a fuck what your conversation was. You and the other dude conversation was just friendly. Everybody's wow. conversation is gonna be just friendly, okay? How you doing? Oh, I hope you're okay. You don't have to say, "Yeah, I wanna fuck you." You don't have to say it. He's what right. Just wanna fuck you. Period. He's and right. You dumb enough to spread your fucking legs while you married. Dumbass bitch. You going to hell, Shonda? Cause you're a hoe. You going Damn. to fucking hell for being a hoe. Wow. Wow. So. There's a couple things that I stood out. I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to be politically correct with you guys, and not be a total asshole. Um, I have a few questions. Like I would ask the dude first. I would ask him, nigga, is you Earthquake the comedian? But they probably from the same area, or some shit. That's why you sound like him. So evidently, she cheated on him before. And he went to some hotel room. He may have caught her at the hotel room. Like, this nigga was on it. He know. It's something... I mean, I guess she went somewhere. I don't fucking know. I didn't, I didn't pay attention. But my thing is... You seem like a smart brother. Why didn't you divorce her when she did that? Like, it's obvious this bitch got some kind of fucked up problems. And then, like... So, I, I, I fought him for that. Nigga, get a divorce. Like, you wasting your time. That bitch is her stupid as shit. I would ask her, what the fuck, dude? Why are you standing there crying like that? Like, that was, I guess she felt, I, she knows she had fucked up. But she was standing there crying like she was about to get a whooping. Like, I feel sorry for, maybe she got her ass whooped. But you would think if she was getting her ass whooped by this dude, she wouldn't be doing that shit. Or maybe she just was like, I guess he said she moved back to California, so maybe she was all alone and 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 just set up shop, wanted to set up shop with him and, and try to do things better. But you guys got to remember, like, anything you do in the dark can come to light. And, and she's stupid because she deleted the main app that he knew she was on fucking with niggas. So, of course, he going to look at the phone and get the app back so he can see what she was doing when she wasn't with him. Anyway, this bitch is 41 years old. That's sad. But uh, overall, it was a good a good watch. Um, I enjoyed myself. If you guys are new to the show, y'all will soon realize that I'm a super hater. So anyone's misfortune makes me giddy. And I'm totally happy. I think the rest of my day will be perfect because I've seen this bitch cry for like five minutes straight. And he said, I'm not screwed in. I I'm fucked up. <laughs> And then what he said, what he said, have a nice night or whatever. And she was like, wait, <laughs> like, like she wanted to turn off the camera. Dude, funny. Funny. I actually got some popcorn and watch this one. This is, that was some funny shit. I'm going to post a link in the description below. Um, whether you agree with me or you don't, comment below and let me know. I'm the Mad Rapper and I'm out. I'm the mad rapper, I speak the truth, I let it flow If you got an opinion, comment below and let me know If you like, please hit subscribe and tell all your friends about the Mad Rapper Show